From here the sound you don't know is the voice of Jade Caprice representing for One Link TV Vlogs. Hear me I say subscribe to the channel. Tell a friend for tell a friend say never stop like, comment and share. You hear that? Good night my viewers and all my subscribers. I'm just giving you a brief update about what happened today. I post a video on my channel and when I post a video, copyright claim come up and need the video. So I have to go ahead and delete back the video. I rebuild back the video and post it on the channel and it's the same thing. I go ahead again and rebuild back over the video and it's the same thing. So if you guys get more than one notification bell from One Link TV vlogs about one video specifically, that is the reason why. So I'm just giving you guys an update what really happened today. So people, tonight I have a small topic I want to discuss with you guys. So people, <coughs> do you ever wonder why corruption, crime and violence cannot get better in Jamaica? Do you guys ever wonder? Well, the system is corrupt. The police them corrupt. The soldier system corrupt. So that's the reason why you cannot get a better Jamaica. I have a video. I'm gonna post it on the channel so you guys can go over and take a watch and see what I'm talking about. Why people? People are really corrupt, you know? The people are really corrupt. You know you're there when I work, right? And all you are try for success in the work. You can't have success. No care what you do. You can what position you get, you can go up, you just there one stage already in your life. I people them in the work, you want you better. Just like in the police force, you have some crab, some really big crab in the police force. And them in the barrel, and once, you, once them can go up, you can go up neither. And them just feel like, say, yo, and them alone to inert everything, and them alone to get beneficial of everything. But people want you guys to. So, Run over and watch a video. Hope you guys like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the post notification bell so you know so I drop a video people. You guys first get notified. Tell a friend to tell another friend. Run, come over to One Link TV vlog. Come check out. We may go out on the channel. Peace out people. Have yourself a wonderful night. Members of the Jamaica Constabulary Force, the JCF in Trelawney. This follows the discovery of several boxes containing personal files that were allegedly concealed by a woman inspector. Files of documents relating to unresolved disciplinary matters, applications for promotions and other benefits which were never submitted. There are questions this afternoon about how the police high command will deal with the revelations which have members of the force uneasy and restive. The High Command Ames has the details. The woman inspector has responsibility for general administration in the Trelawney Police Division. JCF members are accusing the inspector of deliberately hiding the files over several years. As a result, scores of cases have been reportedly stalled. Police sources say that JCF members have suffered unduly. Officers who applied for benefits were never even considered. One JCF member is reportedly off of frontline duty for not re-enlisting because the woman inspector allegedly hid his files. Police sources say the woman inspector has been in this job for some seven years. She was promoted to the rank of inspector earlier this year. Allegations are that the inspector, who's on a junior command course, failed to hand over the key for a storeroom, which she alone had access to. Her office was reportedly searched and the files discovered. The JCF members say a locksmith was hired to change the locks on the door to the storeroom. Boxes of similar files were also allegedly found. Our news team was informed that there are plans to search the inspector's house. 
Senior communication strategist in the JCF, Dennis Brooks, says the matter was brought to the attention of the police high command on Tuesday, October 4. Brooks says instructions were immediately given to begin investigations. The investigations are twofold. The entire filing system in the division is being audited by the ACP admin from the headquarters in Kingston. So there's an auditing element to the probe as well as there is a misconduct investigation that is being progressed by the ACP in charge of Area 1. Brooks confirms that the woman inspector is currently out of office on a training course. He notes that she is not in contact with the office or the files in question. The preliminary information that we can share in terms of discovery of the anomaly is that there was a check being made on a vacation leave matter and when the file could not be found, that's when the anomaly was identified. This triggered a search and the eventual discovery of the files in a room that apparently only the individual had access to. And so the matter was brought before the high command and immediately acted upon. Brooks says given the rank of the individual, the matter will go to the Police Services Commission. We have to prepare the investigation and the evidence and submit it there. By next week, we should have sufficient information to provide an update on where the probe is.